<clears throat> okay, before I begin speech, I want to ask a couple of questions. Why do you believe Jesus? And where does your faith come from? Today, in the world, there are many kinds of church that assert they are true. And 2.2 billion people go to the church, including Wednesday Adventists, right? And most of people, when they choose the church, they just follow their parents or friends or whatever, without belief. Those who went to the church, when they pick up their school or job or whatever, they, uh, they consider a lot and they found a lot of information and compared what the best is. But when they choose the church, they just go and sit and hurt. And one day, uh, and one day, the sermon was impressed. They just, they just pick without any information or like faith. I think if someone go to the church, they are not only be impressed from his work, but also know about his existence. So. I found out one formula that understands Jesus' existence. So I will tell you a part of Israel's history. This story will be able to help to understand Jesus and make your decision. If you have a Bible, let's look at the John chapter 3, verse 1. Now, there was a man of the Pharisees and named Nicodemus, a ruler of the Jews. Verse 2. This man came to Jesus by night and said to him, Lapi, we know that you are a teacher come from God, for no one can do this sign that you do unless God is with you. At night, Nicodemus, who was ruler of the Jews, he visited Jesus and said to him, I saw your sign. What is the sign? Okay. Let's go to the John chapter 2, verse 18 through 20, 21. I believe everyone knows this story, so we will skip this one and just look, just focus on my single word. Verse 13, the Passover of the Jews was at hand, and Jesus went up to Jerusalem. There is Passover, and verse 18, the Jews then said to him, what sign have you to show us for doing this? And there is, we can find the sign, right? And verse 19, Jesus answered them, destroy this temple, and in three days I will raise it up. But, and 21, but he spoke of the temple of his body. What is the sign? The sign is cross and resurrection, right? So, and what happened there? Verse 20, the Jews then said, It has taken 46 years to build this temple, and will you raise it up in three days? From verse 20, 
people didn't realize the sign. However, Nicodemus was there and signed. So, at that night, he visited Jesus and he talked about the sign. But, unfortunately, he couldn't understand exactly. Because, when he learned theology, he didn't study Old Testament a lot. He just came and focus on just law or ethic or like kind of historical something. So he couldn't understand what Jesus said. Later, when he came back to the home, his mind was so complicated because he wanted to know that Jesus is right, but he didn't figure out. Question. Do you know what he did after he what Jesus didn't do? He opened the Bible and found. Can you imagine what did he see? When Nicodemus saw the sign, it was Passover. And where in the Bible do we find the first record, record of God about Passover? Exodus? Exodus. Let's look up to Exodus chapter 12. Chapter 12, verse 2. This month shall be for you the beginning of months. It shall be the first month of the year for you. God said first month. That means January, right? And verse 3. Tell all the congregation of Israel that on the tenth day of this month, they shall take every man a lamb according to their father's houses, a lamb for a household. And he picked up January and tenth day and verse five. Can I write? Yeah. January. And verse 5, your lamb shall be without blemish, and a male, or a year old. You shall take it from a sheep or from the goat. Without blemish. That means perfect. Perfect, right? So, perfect. And verse 6. And you shall keep it until the 14th day of this month, when the whole assembly of the congregation of Israel shall kill their lambs in the evening. Uh, from the in the Hebrew, in the evening, it is means called it is called Ben Harbaim. And that means between the two evenings. Like in English, it is the twilight. Like the sun is going, sun is rays, and so when when the sun is first like sundown is like afternoon, right? And and then like after six six p.m. the day is getting dark, right? That is like second evening. And like first evening is afternoon. So between the between between the two evening, it is called 3 p.m. And 14th day. And verse 7. And they shall take up take up the blood. 